Hi, this short tutorial is for doctors, business owners to find out how people choose a business to contact. When they go online, they do a search, which business they contact first. We have three categories of businesses, those that have bad reputation, uh, which uh, have, a, have bad reviews online. These businesses are in verge of bankruptcy these days and no one wants to contact them or deal with them. Uh, the ones that have a, uh, that uh, that have no reputation, people don't want to deal with these businesses either because they feel like they have no reputation. People want to see reviews from uh, you know uh, on, they want to see online reviews. They want to they want to know who that business is and what kind of reputation they have before they spend money on them. And those that have a five star reputation, the ones that have a five star rep reputation, they get divided in two parts. Those that have more five-star reviews than all the other competitors in the area are the, are the businesses that are getting all the calls, or are the, the, those are the ones that are getting the first call. So let's go to if they want to price around, you know, the ones that have more five-star reviews, they get the first call. So let's go to uh, okay here. Reviews are everywhere. These days, reviews are on Google Map, Yelp, City Search, in all the directories, even Google PPC, uh, Facebook, uh, pretty much everywhere. 92% of people contact businesses based on the online reviews. Every these are this is a research that was done at Harvard University's Business Center. Every star rating that drops in popular directories brings 20% of the business down. So if your five star rating becomes four stars, 20% of your business is gone. If your five star rating becomes one star, 80% of your business is gone. Okay? So, and 87% of those that are being referred to, to your business by a friend or a family member, they check your reviews before calling you. So even those businesses that are claiming that, you know, we're, we're on referrals, uh, we get mo most of our clients, you know, they, they get referred to us, but when someone refers a business to someone else, they still, 87% of those people, they still Googled th that business. They Google you because they want to find all the information about your business and they want to check your reviews. And as soon as you Google a business name or a doctor's name, everything that pops up on first page of Google are reviews. So no matter what kind of marketing you do, SEO, online, TV ads, magazine, radio, it all comes back to your reviews because people are going to be Googling you before contacting you. This is why reviews have become the mother of all the marketing that you do. CBS News announced that business owners should have a gatekeeper in order to protect their online reputation. So basically, not only you should protect your online uh, reputation, you also have to keep increasing your online reviews because people also check the data of the reviews. So in this slide, it says 92% of people uh, now read online reviews for local businesses. Okay, so we see how important it is, you know, to uh, have these online reviews. Let's go to this slider here. For example, for a keyword like Dentist Palm Beach, 2,400 people search for that keyword last month. Then the Chiropractor Chicago, 8,100 people searched on Google for these keywords. You see, all these different keywords. So when people do a search and Obviously, you wouldn't buy a product or service that has bad reviews, okay? But if two products or services have identical, that, that the two businesses that are offering identical services, one has 10 good star reviews and the other one has three good star, five star reviews and one bad review or even no bad reviews, but three five star reviews, which one would you pick? Obviously, you're gonna pick the business that has more five-star reviews than the other competitors. So this is why reviews are extremely important and reviews are everywhere. Uh, let me go to this. This is an old slider. Re the reviews used to show up like this, but now you see the star ratings. So reviews are all over these days. You know, they're on Google Map, they're on pay-per-click website. Uh, they affect your website's ranking. 
you want to get better ranking you need to get better more reviews on Google map they uh, affect your organic ranking and uh, lo in local directories so here 92% of people can't uh, basically you know like uh, when they get referred to a business you know they want to contact that business by a family member or a friend and even out of this 92%, 87%, as we saw in the previous slide, they still check that business on the internet before contacting them. 70% of people, and this, this, this was an older research, you know, this was about like seven, eight years ago. Uh, they go based on right after uh, recommendations, referrals, they go after online reviews. And then, you know, they contact businesses based on newspaper articles, you know, and other form of ads. Uh, but you see how important online reviews are. And this number, this 70% has reached to 92% now. This is a research that was done eight years ago, but now it's much more. So pretty much everybody, you know, is, is checking your reviews before contacting you. Now, how are we gonna increase the five-star reviews? What should we do? Because that's the missing puzzle of a lot of businesses marketing. And uh, uh, if they wanna maximize their conversion rate, they need to get more reviews. It's as simple as that. So what we do, okay, here, which business would you call? The business that has uh, uh, five basically that has excellent reviews five star reviews a five star reputation or the business that has offers the cheapest service or the business that came up first on Google search result so research shows that the majority of the people are contacting the business that has five, a five that has a five star reputation so in order to increase your reviews what we do we give you a, you have to have a tablet and we're going to give you a page you open this page this page becomes your signing page basically when people uh, when patients walk in or, or your customers walk in you hand over the tablet to them uh, or you can put the tablet right here on a tablet holder and they sign up this is high tech it uh, instead of putting their name you know on a pa piece of paper or so something they sign up right here on the tablet they put their name email address phone number time and date is automatically set based on the time and date they walk in so you don't have to do anything and they hit sign in once they hit sign in they get a check mark that they have been signed in when they do that three hours or four hours depending on how we set, uh, set it a text message is going to go to them an email and a text message asking for their feedback and they see the link, they click on the link, and they get forwarded. Let me show you here. Okay. So when they when they click on that link, they get forwarded to a page that says, would you recommend us, yes or no? Those that click on no, which is rare, most other, most other uh, patients and customers, you know, like based on the research that we have done, 90, more than uh, about 98, 99%, they're all happy. So they click yes. When they click yes, they get redirected to a page that they see Yelp, Google, Facebook, you know, whatever we put here, you know, it depends on which directory is, is more important to you. So uh, they get redirected to that. And once they click on these logos, they get redirected to your Yelp page and they put that five star review there right here they put the five they select five star and they put the review there this platform is so smart that those that are using an android uh, phone you know those samsung uh, android phones uh, but overall any android platform it can even detect that they already downloaded yelp's app or google's app or facebook's app on their cell phone and it opens up that page as soon as you click on, for example, Yelp. And depending on in what order you're putting, for example, if Yelp is the most important for you, we put Yelp on top. And when, when they're using an Android uh, tablet, when they click on that link uh, to put the review, automatically Yelp is going to open up on their screen. 
if I put Google, uh, if we put Google, uh, on, Google on top, Google is going to open up first. So depending on which directory is the most important. If they're using an Apple platform, they're going to see all three directories, three or four, whatever directory we put in here. So there, it's because some people have a Yelp account, some people have a Gmail account. Everybody has these days. Everybody either has a Gmail account or a Facebook account or a Yelp account. Okay. In, uh, in this screenshot, you don't see Facebook, but we see we put Facebook here too. And uh, wherever they have an account, they just click on it and they put the review in there. You have to increase reviews in public directories, in popular directories, Yelp, Google, and these directories. Not reviews, you know, that goes, goes to uh, th those private pages. Those uh, other uh, directories, you know, people don't really care popular directories that come up on Google search result you know like those are the directories that people care about if they click on no thanks if they're not recommending you they click on no thanks then they're gonna go to a page that they're being asked to fill out uh, you know like that what is it that they're complaining about what was the problem here so they fill that out once they submit it this goes to the office manager this way the office manager gets notified and they can contact them and resolve the issue and, and this way they'll never go public. You, so you'll never get a bad review in any other public directories. When you don't do this, then be, people, you know, like when somebody's upset about something, they have to complain somewhere. At that point, they go to these public directories and put a bad review for you. So this is how you beat your competitors. If you want to maximize your, your conversion rate, if you, you need to get more five-star reviews than all the other competitors in the area, on in all the popular directories. So, and then uh, our platform tracks everything. Uh, let's go to the other uh, slider here. Then we take those five-star reviews. Those five-star reviews, they go on your website. Let me just show here how that uh, looks like. Okay, the five star reviews, they go on your website. There is going to be a tab here. There is a tab here on the website and you see all the five star reviews. I, I want you to notice something here. As you see, it shows the logo of the directory where that uh, review is coming from. It shows the nick nickname of the review, reviewer, and the, the review itself. So, and if they click on this logo, it's going to take them to that page, you know, where the review is coming from. So let's go back. This is the kind of page that people trust because not those other kind of pages, you know, that some doctors, you know, they put those text reviews, you know, like they collect some reviews and they put it there. People want to see reviews coming from public directories, you know, um, and, and let's go to the Yelp page of this business. Let's go to here. Let me, I'm sorry. I'm just trying to find that page. Okay. For example, in this case, Tyson Smiles has only one reviews on Yelp. Okay. Why? Because Yelp, and that's why there's a, there are a lot of complaints about Yelp and uh, and uh, you know lawsuits and all that stuff. There's one review, but eight other reviews have been filtered. You know, a lot of business owners are complaining to Yelp because these are legit reviews coming from uh, their their actual customers. You know, but Yelp, uh, a lot of them, Yelp is claiming, you know, like there, there, there might be spam, you know, but, but research shows there are a lot, the, a lot of these reviews are legit reviews, but Yelp is pretty much hiding them, and um, is not showing them. So, but what our platform does, let's go to the website here. But as you see on 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 the website, we have one, two three, four, this one is coming from Facebook, <coughs> I'm sorry, five, six, seven, eight. We have eight reviews, eight, nine, nine Yelp reviews are showing up. Why? Because it pulls out all the filtered reviews too and brings it to the surface. So your fans and followers see that. Business owners are complaining Yelp is filtering our reviews. 
but our platform is pulling those reviews out and putting it on their website not only puts it on the website it also markets it in social media platforms so these reviews by our softwares they go to your Facebook page Twitter page Instagram page so all your fans and followers they see that and then let's go to this other training and then we convert those reviews to a video format with professional spokes models that work for news channels and we rank those videos on top of YouTube and Google videos so all you have to do you see how many things are happening in the back end that way you get YouTube first page ranking so let's go to uh, I want to go to YouTube here I want to show you something on YouTube Let's type in, like for example, best dentist. This is just an example. You see how this, uh, uh, what happened when people go to YouTube, they search these keywords, best dentist Northridge. We rank those videos, those reputation videos on the first page of uh, YouTube for different keywords. Like in this case, you know, it's best dentist Northridge. Let's click on this. It's unbelievably rewarding to see people so excited about our top-level service. This great five-star review really motivates our team to keep working even harder. We're really happy to share this great feedback with everyone. This is a powerful testament to our policies and procedures that always ensures a five-star experience with us. As you can see, we truly pay attention to everyone's needs. So as you see, we make the videos, we rank it on top of uh, YouTube, and uh, in, in some cases they even get ranked on Google. Let's go to Google now. I want to type in a keyword like dental implant, I'm sorry, dental implant Malibu. Do you see how this video is ranked? Uh, you know it's number one actually this is a paid ad it's number one on YouTube and if I go to Google videos it is number one here too that is a video that we ranked on top of uh, Google search result and uh, Google videos and if you go to YouTube now and type in the same keyword You see that video is right there number one too these are paid ads so this is why uh, uh, so this is called reputation marketing now in regards to this business here I'm gonna check Tyson here yeah you see you have one reviews on Yelp but when people go to Yelp these are other businesses you know these are the dentists in Vienna they have 20 this one has 21 reviews this one has 15 this one has 78 so they have more five star reviews than you do this is why they contact them first before contacting you this is the missing puzzle here see all the other businesses they have much more reviews the same is on google let's go to google now look this business these are businesses that are in vienna virginia for uh, you know in the same location of uh, tyson and uh, this one has 247 reviews 218 reviews you know like 65 reviews there are a lot of businesses you know and that's what people do they scan from top to bottom you know, on Google map in Yelp you know they quickly scan and the one that has more five-star reviews than the other competitors they call that business first first this is this is why this is the mother of all the marketing that you do 
okay so just wanna and all of this is accomplished by you putting this tablet you know uh, some businesses uh, they uh, the front uh, front desk staff they just open this page and uh, all they do is to put their name uh, the, put the patient's name email address and phone number here and hit uh, sign in when they do that everything is happening you know like automatically and some other businesses they just put it on a tablet holder and let they let the customers or patients themselves put their data in there or there okay put the info in there so you, it's whatever you like to do you know it, it's fine all that needs to be done is uh, you know like to have a tablet and they put the info here they hit sign in everything else that you saw creating the videos and and you know increasing the reviews in public directories putting the reviews on the website going to social media pages the review is gonna go to all the social media platforms Facebook Twitter wherever you you, you know you have a social media uh, profile and uh, so all your fans and followers they see that too so this is extremely important you have to do this in order to maximize your conversion rate beat your competitors and get more calls and generate more sales all right uh, if you have any questions just uh, contact professional optimizer or medical optimizer at 818-570-3363 and we'll be glad to help you out all right, thank you very much.